You know, everything happened so quickly. It was just a random shooting. And we were on our way to work, and uh, it was me, my uncle, and my cousin, because we all worked together. That's when they started shooting from behind us, and uh, they shot two times in the back. The second bullet hit, it hit, shattered the glass, and I ended up ducking. It could have hit my head, but I had my hands up, and that's when I got hit from the hand. I could have lost my life that day. And my phone rings and I saw that it was my brother. Immediately my heart started pounding because I know my son lives with my brother and he never calls me that early. So I pick up the phone and he just said, you need to get to the hospital. Um, and I heard my brother say he is, he's at MIHS and um, intertwined with all those chaotic feelings and, and pain and distress, I felt a sense of comfort um, as a mother because I know what an excellent trauma center MIHS is being I've worked here for eight years. They, they were giving me medicine and everything. They said they were, it was a possibility of getting my hand amputated. He was in the critical care area, bed one, and there was a lot of residents and you know, ER docs and nurses. I looked over and he, his hand was swollen, um, a hole straight through it. You could see the bone and the flesh. It was something like out of a movie. It was horrific. They put me uh, into surgery right away. The people who did surgery on my hand, you know, I got, I got to thank them because, you know, if it wasn't for them, you know, my hand wouldn't be as healthy as it is as today, you know. Uh, at that time, they didn't know I was an employee, and they still treated um, myself and my son very well. And then when I, when I ended up waking up, you know, I ended up with a little bit of pain, but, you know, they put me in a comfortable room. You know, they, they treated me with, with good care. And during that time, you know, that's when they had physical therapy for me. Um, EVS was amazing. If it wasn't for food services um, being so efficient, um, my son, after not eating for almost two days, would have had to wait longer for that meal. If it wasn't for IT and their all their hard work, I saw it firsthand. I want to even highlight registration. They did an amazing job. You know, departments that you don't think medical, you always think, you know, surgeons, nurses. And of course, they played a big part in my son's recovery. No, they told me I have no nerve damage, you know, so I'm thankful for that. And, uh, but I do have a metal plate in my hand. I feel like my appreciation um, jumped so much for all those departments. It was an eye opening for me, so I, I am determined to put more zeal into my job to do my part as an employee, to show compassion. They do this job for a reason, because they want to help people, and they help me.